So you'll start. Well, a lot of uh, the jobs uh, that traditionally people think of in the oil and gas uh, industry, uh, you, you would think would be associated. And so one of the things, uh, whether it be uh, landscaping, surveying, um, it could be uh, if you go into Jefferson, Carroll County, I mean, John Deere dealerships, they're sold out of farm equipment. Um, it's the restaurants, um, the hotels are filled. Um, I'm trying to get to your point because, like, for example, in North I have Carolina, a heavy machine. Heavy machine, thank you. Heavy there's equipment. so many ways I could have gone here. Um, what we're trying to do with, uh, and we've always done this, so this isn't new, is that you work with um, local companies. Um, our sister organization, the Ohio Oil Gas uh, Association, as well as us, we're working more in the job training. But we're doing a lot with the Chamber of Commerce. We're working a lot with the business-to-business -business <coughs> development as an industry to make sure, for example, if you've got a small, uh, you've got a heavy equipment, but typically, the last 150 years we haven't done business with you is number one to make sure that those specs on your heavy equipment operators are up to spec. Uh, keep in mind some of our locations uh, we could be drilling well on the side of the hill. So we need to make sure the type of heavy equipment, we need to make sure that for example you've gone through certain training uh, especially in areas of safety. Uh, before I'm going to hire you, I also want to make sure that your company meets our required, it's called a master service agreement, that you've got the minimum insurance requirements. Also in our reporting capabilities, I want to make sure you can access uh, wireless control. So as an industry, we're trying to do a lot and we have been literally in, in so many communities across the state working with the schools, putting on the business-to-business -business development, and that's really where it starts because um, we need to find out about you, um, but within those master service agreements, if you do not comply within that, we're just simply not going to be able to hire you.